In this video, I'm going to discuss the options for search criteria in Course Search. To make things easier, Course Search knows your name and your degree level. And while it's not on the page, it also knows what campus you attend. It uses this information to set default parameters on the search page. But you don't have to be limited to the defaults. You can select any campus you want and any degree level you want. So, for this example, I'm going to pick IUPUI undergraduate classes. The next thing you have to select is what term you want to search. The options are any term, projected terms, scheduled terms, and specific terms such as fall 2013. Any term does just what it says. It will look for courses and classes in any term. Projected terms will look for courses that appear in semesters that haven't been scheduled yet, but we have a pretty good idea that those courses will be offered based on when they're typically offered. And scheduled terms looks only for terms that have a released schedule of classes. If you pick a specific term, your search results will be limited to the classes that appear in that term. Next up, we have the Big Magic search box, which accommodates a variety of different search terms. For example, I can type the name of a subject such as English. Or I could type in a specific class I'm interested in, if I know the number. Here's English L202, which is a literary interpretation class. I can also type in a keyword. So let's say I'm interested in seeing what at IUPUI deals with the Middle Ages. I can type in the word medieval. Once I've typed in my search, I just press go, or if I'm on a device with a keyboard, I can press enter. That's basically it for the search criteria. In the next video, we'll take a look at some search results.